And I thought the tone of the guy that wrote up um, this one was better than the tone of the guy that wrote up the other one, if that makes sense. So we've got our Countess as the, uh, our primary mech pilot, our commander. The Revenants is obviously the deal, so we went with my little baddie logo that I'd made earlier. Since we're... We're undead. Um, so this will now also affect um, medical and um, med techs and mech techs. So we get more points based on this. It is an, it is an adorbs bat. I, uh, I actually paid for that asset at some point, I think for our vampire Rimworld save on YouTube. And I figured I paid for it. I'm using it. So I ripped him out of the art and we, we made some we made some logos out of him. Um, I'd like to take credit for designing him, but not so much. Yeah, the overhauls are interesting, but we couldn't get the map as a pick and choose. We had to take an overhaul for it. Um, he's just not available standalone anymore. Anyway, so this will boost everything. So it'll get us more med techs and more mech techs. So I think we don't do it this turn, though. Early on, I think we just have to kind of suck it up. Hiring hall, though. But we are at six of six berths, so we'll hold off on that. And that wasn't what I meant to hit anyway, so we'll just kind of skip through it. All right. Argument draws you into the mess. Baron starts towards you, red-faced and scowling. Commander, I hate to bother you with, but Scion says... Scion is slacking off again. Well, fair enough. We're supposed to share garbage detail, but he, share? You want to share? Commander, this asshole's the reason we're on cleanup duty in the first place. They act like they're my boss. Just last week, they filed two dozen complaints with the XO and got us both on garbage detail. And they did it over nothing. An infraction's an infraction, Baron sneers. If you stop messing up, I'll stop reporting you. <laughs> I guess we go after both of them. I mean, if you don't want people to report you... Stop doing the wrong thing, Scion. I mean, that's fair enough, I think, right? But, you know, come on. We're teammates here. You step in between the infuriated mech warriors holding your hands up. This ends today. I don't know what's really going on between you, but no more boss and Scion around and no more slacking. You're both better than this. The mech warriors begrudgingly agree that they don't look directly at one another. Noticing the reticence, reticence, reticence. There we go. It's reticence. You gesture for both of them to step forward. Not that long ago, you two got along just fine. What happened? Scion looks up. I'm just tired of Baron getting all the praise from Darius. Baron blinks in surprise. You're jealous of me? I was annoyed that the rest of the mech warriors just kept going on and on about your antics. I want to take you down a peg. You incline your head. Sounds like you both have a lot to discuss and plenty of time. I won't hold back. Baron looks Scion in the eyes. He shrugs and reaches for a trash can. Not going anywhere. So Scion is no longer rebellious. And Baron gained honest. Uh, do we? Oh, yeah, we, we can boost another one. That one's done. Good point. Thank you, Undesirable. Um, so now, for, again, for those of you that haven't seen this, pilot tags matter. So, rebellious meant that if we put Scion in any lance with an officer or with commander, that he would get less, um, he'd get negatives towards his resolve, right? So now, he doesn't have that anymore. And in theory, and I think that was his only, that was his only quirk, so it's gone. Um, so let's take a look at Baron, noble and honest. So mood changes based upon funding, whether she's happy or pissed off, really just depends on the money we're spending. Um, but honest now, so increased company morale overall. Um, if you start out military, you get more XP to start with. Um, so yeah, I think that's fine. Um, cautious, he's harder to hit, which is why we're putting him in like the locust and stuff kind of stack as many penalties as we can get for that. So that's what they do. Um, I'm going to go piloting. Training. Again, I want more. How's it going? Kind of get everything up to four, and then we'll kind of pick. Complete. But early on, piloting is kind of important. Training confirmed, Commander. So is gunnery. Standing by. Um, Training complete. Orders? Hmm. There we go. Slickson, ah, Mech you are, uh, you're trouble is what you are. Commander. 
Um, brave, so you get more panic resistance, or you better rolls for it, and you got you got more XP to start with because you're military. So, and you also started with um, with bulwark, so you are guarded. You get um, forty percent damage reduction instead, which is standard. No, no real change on that. Um, Stonehenge. Boost a couple of those. And Countess is done. And Stonehenge has, in case anybody's interested and wants to be named after Stonehenge. Noble. Again, mood, mood based on funding. So. All right. Yeah, I pretty much do too. And then I kind of figure out, at that point, we'll see who's still alive and where I want to start specializing in. And maybe we have some different mechs by that point. But. I don't know. We've arrived at our destination, Commander. We can visit the store. I don't think it's going to have much. It is supposed to be an unpopulated planet. Uh, nothing fancy. Some ammo. Some jump jets. Stuff we're going to need. Um, let's take a look at the contracts. We got some half, we got a half skull. Yes, we're doing it. <laughs> Show of force, escort in the desert. Um, okay. Oh, we can get the three by just jumping up one. I think we do it that way. If we can get the three by doing that, I think we do it. Um, stinger is mediums. Uh, I'm going to go with the locust again, just because I like locusts. That's really the only real reason. Um, Same lance as we dropped with, well, you know what? Let's, yeah, let's go with this lance. For now. Um, in fact. Mexo. Yep. <laughs> um, I think I'm actually going to put Baron in. There. We'll go kind of with the lower... Slickson's the only one with fours and fives in there um, because this is the one half skull mission. So that's here on the planet. And then we'll flip over to the full, the harder lands for the second run through with the one skull. Fatigue's going to be an issue. Injuries are going to be an issue early. I say we just don't have much armor. Fights are going to be kind of fast and brutal. Uh, need a mercenary company capable of defending the convoy and deterring any hostile force that may want what it's carrying. Payment will be remitted upon receipt of the convoy, yada, yada, yada. Oh, well, I got to pause. Don't forget to follow if you'd like the notifications as we play. We play every day except Saturday. Uh, generally kind of middle of the afternoon California time, one to four, two to five, depending on my, my class schedule, since I teach. Um, yeah, the Firestar is a good, good early mech. I kind of wish we would have got the, one of the more melee focused ones early. We got the large laser one, but um, we've done really well with it. So I, I have absolutely zero complaints with the way it's worked so far. Uh, am I really moving all the way up here? Let's move to here. Let's move. I probably should have gone up to be harder to hit, actually. That's okay. He stayed low. Like I say, our evasion doesn't seem to do much, but... Their evasion makes him harder to hit. Um... Can't quite get there... yet. Acknowledged. Order. I can get a shot here, though. On the move. Firing on target. I say ours are not quite as good. Good to go. Um, I think we go up top again. Let's move. Take whatever elevation bonus we can get here. Man, he's just killing ours before we even get a chance to do anything. I hate these guys. <laughs> My nose itches. Crap, ah, mustache. That shot went internal. Um, I just punch you. 
But we may as well do the punch. It leaves us in the trees. And we get the machine guns. If we shot him, it would just be machine guns. I thought about running around behind him, but... Yes, Commander. You know, everybody else would be... Uh, that's a 66%. If we go here... We'll go with the large laser. It does more damage. AI cheats. It sure does feel like it sometimes. I will one of these days. I, I actually downloaded .NET Framework and... Um, critical hit. The Microsoft programming whatever environment, you know. Um, so I could look at the DLLs. Uh, but I haven't... I haven't... I haven't done enough to dig into them yet. Copy that. Um, yeah, we risked the AC shot. Watch us lose the AC-5 again. I know, he's just, he's a torso twist and fool. He's done pretty well, actually. I mean, he's lost some stuff, but, um, but we're going to keep punching him. Again, we got machine guns on ours, so. Position confirmed. And he ejected. No, no, not like this. I'm gonna have to get um, BB Wolf or one of the other, you know, somebody else to like give me some um, voice recordings of people with their ejection calls, and then we can we can play them when they happen. I think that'd be fun. Um, uh, let's go to where maybe we get sensors but don't get shot. Oh, that's probably it actually, because this is the. Escort. So that was probably the Coordinates received. the defensive. What? Um, let's go here. Let's move. And here. Moving to position. And here. And then we'll go here. I copy. Head now. Oh, this is the one we had the the bug on that last last save, wasn't it? Where they refused to drive down the ramp. We have. Is anybody gonna be shoots back? SRM sixes and flamers. Uh, machine guns and SRMs. Okay, not bad. I'm here. Uh, we haven't seen an op for at this point, so we might not have one until they get there. Uh, I think we just stay here so we don't get too much of an advanced start on them. We might already. See if all four of them drive. Yep, that's exactly it. The landing force was a single. It is a half star mission. <laughs> Roger. On the move. Hmm. I'll keep my heat down. Roger. Come on, guys, you can do it. You can do it. There we go. There we go. Sometimes it's hard to tell if they're not moving just because they're not moving, or because you're too far away, or because they've got their little spacing, you know that they want, and that's what they're doing. Good to go. So last time I did this, the Op 4 came from up there. Yep, you certainly do, Larian. They, they will... Occasionally, they'll even follow you off the path. So they'll supposed to be go there, but the guy that's close maybe runs up here to fight. He'll follow you and then take a long route. He won't go back. You'll have to find a circular route to get him back to it. We've run into that bug a couple times. Copy that. Move order received. There we go. That should give everybody a nice line to get in there. And there's the pirate assault team. Hold this position. See, now I like to run everybody up there, and then I end up with, like, one guy right here, right? <laughs> See? And look. 
this guy's doing his own thing. Where's he going? Who knows? But now we have to keep somebody back here to babysit him. On my way. And there's no trees there. Copy that. Position confirmed. He just couldn't, you think he just couldn't get through the other guy? Well, let's hope he'll turn around here this next turn. We'll keep people back a little bit. I want to know why the leopard can't defend itself. Why can't he shoot things? All right, we have story missions where we use our leopard to fight off pirates, so it's got guns. Aye, aye. Um, a Jenner? SRMs and lots of medium lasers. That could be dangerous. Um, but I think we just run around. Right here. We stay a long ways away and in the trees. Fast. Are they both gen? Uh, no, the other is a stinger. Okay. Standing by. Jump to the trees and use the large laser. 51, 41. Copy that. Reporting critical hit. Yeah. It's funny because the Jenners, I think... No, I don't remember. We looked at... Jenners were definitely in the... Um, they were in the Kirita group of mechs. Um, I don't think we saw them in, in the Marroquins at all, but... Standing by. They weren't... Come on, guys. You need to... I want to move the Clint out of here. You need to move in there. Drive. There's one. Nope, they're just driving that way. Nothing to do with the path. Aye, aye. There. Still in the trees, still got evasion. At least the Jenner's gonna have to move to shoot me. And now everybody else gets to shoot him. Waiting for orders. They're avoiding the thick wood. Oh yeah, that could be. Um, aye, woods aye. are supposed to cut down um, on vision as well, like total vision that you can see, um, as are the sandstorms. So how that's gonna work, I, I don't know, but it's got it. in theory in here. So. Yes, Commander. Can I get the small lasers on him? I can. Good to go. Although I think I'd rather take the higher hit chance with the mediums. What do you need? Let's reserve and see if that guy drives in and so we can get him out of the way there. We gotta keep him one more turn. Yep. However, I'm gonna jump to here. Yeah, it might just be a pathing thing for that. They have different pathing than mechs have. I wonder. Standing by. That guy's got a lot. Um, of course, the negative now is we don't have any evasion. But we got into the structure there, and he ran away. I've got an enemy to the well, he ran after the cicada. Not sure what happened there. Oh, he got in the back of us and we lost a medium laser. Oh wait, that's what happened. I was like, I don't, I didn't see what happened. Um, let's see, if we just shoot, uh, if I go here, and we turn like that, pretty decent chances. If I go to get in his back, come on. Oh, I guess it already, I guess it, it didn't let me preview it. It just gave, moved it. Okay. All right, now I know what's going on. I was like, why can't I back up and try moving somewhere else? Because it, it didn't give me the preview, it gave me the move. Much trip, very kick, such. <laughs> um, 
I go here. Now we can shoot him in the back. It's okay. We're getting a little bit of revenge again. He's, he's in pretty bad shape for somebody who's still standing. Ready for orders. Start spreading the Clint up. We can hop over the hill next time and get him with that new AC5. And they don't like the cicada, do they? Somebody is not a fan of the chicken mix. Aye, aye. Um, I'm going to go here to stay in the trees. Confirmed. You laugh, but our last save, we did it. We, we had no lower arms and no medium lasers. And I think we had to buy heat sinks at one point, too, because we don't have any salvage. And you get so little right now. If you just didn't get it in the salvage, you didn't get it. Um, and I think we shoot him in the back with everything. Confirmed. Yeah. Leg, a torso, and an arm. And he just ran. Because why wouldn't you? Perfect. Um, I guess that's it. We're just waiting on... Oh, is that guy not... Oh, and he didn't go because we moved away. Position you confirmed. dumbass. Good to go. Location confirmed. Objective secured. Oh no, I don't know where to go. I'm one hex out. That might be something I change. I might have to go into the... into the advanced AI mod and find the waiting for that. Yeah, everybody ran away. He's like, quick, let's go to sleep. There's people shooting at us, but man, I haven't had a nap in ages. Or a smoke break, right? He's like, ah. Let me just nip outside for a minute, but we got to get into the ship. Nah, we'll be fine. Um, Jenner D's. I think so. Um, and we might need to replace that medium laser, so we'll take that. And we got all of the mech parts. SRM4, some jump jets. Fair enough. Old Bear, 1970, we hadn't seen you yet. I was worried about you. Um, Reconis Chew? Reconis Chew? You have to let me know. B and K, welcome. Here go pros. How you doing today? And Grado, 1987. Good to see you. There we go. And we took uh, minimal uh, damage, I'd say, on this one. It was a half skull, but, you know. Do have to replace our medium laser. Lost a winglet there. Actually, that's... Well, I guess we fixed it pretty fast. I'm kind of wondering... Do we want to... Do I have more small lasers? I got more small lasers. I have a... I got two, I got those two plus five flamers. Would we like to do something similar to what we did where we get rid of the medium lasers? We go with support weapons. Uh, well, we only have two support weapons. Never mind. I think what I'm actually going to do is get rid of the small laser and just go with two medium lasers. And take the extra ton that way. Because, I mean, we've got no armor on this thing. I mean, he's, he's 40 tons, but there's nothing. Thank you for the, uh, the reality check. I mean, I don't think you can... I don't think you can get max armor at all. I mean, if we just go with this... That's with nothing on it. <laughs> we can't get anywhere near Max. <laughs> That's funny. Don't 
Yeah, I mean, it's it's more heat, but I don't know that we're going to put up enough heat on these mechs to matter at this point, especially since he nerfed the heat a little bit. Um, he says it's more nuanced. Um, so I think we just go medium lasers. The problem is we have a mech that's based on speed and evasion, but we don't have pilots that can build any of that evasion in. So you just end up with a mech that doesn't have any armor. You know, that's that's the biggest issue. Um, we'll give it a couple days to fix the mechs. And we may as well wait one more day to get some pilots back. That work order you submitted? In fact, Slickson, because he... I don't remember what his quirk is. He gets back earlier. So let's go ahead now and take the next one. Nope, this one does. I, I thought this one was supposed to have the whole mech, the bigger mech bay thing in it, but doesn't appear to. And that's fine. Um, it'll make the save go faster. We're not spending as much time in the mech bay working on that sort of thing. Um, S, another escort, ambush convoy, just a battle in the desert. Um, well, this is a better salvage one. So let's take this one first. We might get something we need. Go for three again. Um, 